activity 4 convert the following so this one what is the question 500 millimeter into centimeter see king harry died mother didn't cry much in this what they said mm to centimeter that means we have move for backward below if it is there and see the arrow that means it is backward divided by how much 10 suppose if it was in the forward it was multiplication now it is division 50 mm is equals to 50 divided by 10 centimeter if you divide or cancel the zeros you'll get answer as 5 centimeter Question number 2, 142 millimeter into centimeter. Write down sentence, King Harry died, mother didn't cry much. So again, mm to cm we went. That means divide by 10. If you divide by 10, 14 centimeter and 2 millimeter will be answer. Next, 625 centimeter to M only. That means, write down the sentence and see, CM to M. CM to M we went. That means, back by 2 units. So, divide by 100. 625 divided by 100. If you divide, 2 units will be in. smaller units and then 6 as in the hundreds so 6 meter and 25 centimeter will be the answer next 5285 centimeter into meter see again centimeter to meter backward by 2 units divide by 100 so 85 will be in centimeter and 52 will be in meters. Question number 5. 921 dm into m. dm to m is only just 10 units. So, divide by 10. So, how much will it be? 1 will be dm and 92 will be m. Next, 827 dm into m. dm to m is 10 units. So, divide the unit given question in by 10. So, 827 gets divided by 10 means 7 will be dm and 82 will be m. Eight thousand m into kilometer, kilometer, m two km it is. That shows backward. Backward means division divided by thousand. We'll get eight kilometers. The next nine thousand two hundred and fifty seven meter into kilometer. Once again, backward by three units, so it gets divided by thousand. So nine thousand. 257 meter is there so 9 kilometer 257 meter will be the answer next 6578 meter into kilometer again backward by 3 units so divide by 1000 it will be 6 kilometer 578 meters next is Measuring of weight. In this we have, we are having a basic unit as gram. Always G will be included in writing the measuring units. If it is bigger, kg, then gram and then milligram. How we are measuring these things? In these different measuring units, we are going to measure the grams fruits vegetables and 
grains you people have seen near the vendors vegetable sellers fruit sellers yes or no beam balance weighing machine as well as an electron here also we are going to have the same sentence king kilogram means king harry died grandmother didn't cry much so 1 kg is equals to 1000 gram 1 gram also is 1000 milligram see to move from bigger to smaller unit we are multiplying by 1000 kg gram and milligram three units to move from one to another 1000 units again in the second one Again, thousand units. So like that, we have exercise also. Then smaller to bigger. See, smallest is the milligram and kg is the biggest. To move from small to big, we are going to divide as done in length also. There we had ten units. Here we have thousand. activity 5 convert the following into gram 12 kg is given and you need to convert into gram 1 kg is equals to 1000 gram so 12 gets multiplied by 1000 it becomes 12000 grams 7 kg 256 grams so first convert kg into gram and then you have to add it up Seven gets multiplied by thousand, so seven thousand plus two fifty six grams, it will be seven two five six grams. C, fifteen kg fifteen grams. First multiply by thousand, and then add you'll get fifteen thousand and fifteen grams. Question number two. Convert into milligram. C question is given in gram. You have to convert into Milligrams. So in this whole thing, we have to multiply by thousand. If it is given in the gram, nineteen gram is the multiply by thousand. It becomes nineteen thousand milligram. Well, as B, twenty five grams, then twenty five milligram. So one gram is equal to thousand milligram. So twenty five gets multiplied by thousand plus twenty five. Twenty-five thousand plus twenty-five. Add it, as done in the working note. You'll get the answer. Similarly, multiply by thousand and then add. Question number three. Convert the following into kg. Two thousand three hundred and eighty-seven gram is given. Smallest is given, and you have to go to the biggest gram to kilogram. Backward by thousand units. So divide by thousand, you'll get two kg three hundred and eighty-seven grams. Similarly, six thousand seven hundred grams, seven hundred grams is the. See, it is done. Kg gram milligram. Divide by thousand. So it becomes six kg. Seven hundred grams. Do the similarly C one. Convert the following into grams. The question is given into the smallest unit, milligram, and you have to go to the gram. That means divide by thousand again. So as done in the above, divide by thousand. So four thousand two hundred gram will become. Milligram will become four grams, two hundred milligrams. The next one, three two five five milligram. When divide by thousand, three will become gram. Two hundred and fifty five will become milligram. Do the similar next sum. Then measurement of capacity. According to the container, how much it holds, uh, what is its capacity? That we are going to study in measurement of capacity. 
it is also in the similar king harry died little grandmother didn't cry much one kiloliter is equals to thousand liter so one liter is also is thousand milliliter similar to weight only the changes arises in the measurement of length here also to move forward that is from bigger to smaller we are going to multiply by thousand to move from smaller to bigger that is from ml to kiloliter and all we divide by thousand according to it the activity is activity 6 convert into liter kiloliter to liter the question is in kiloliter you have to convert into liter that means from bigger to smaller we are going to multiply by 1000 15 gets multiplied by 1000 it becomes 15000 liters b 8 kiloliter and 8 liter here convert the kiloliter and add the 8 liter 8 gets multiplied by 1000 plus 8 if you do 8000 plus 8 it will be 8008 liter then next convert into ml the a 28 liter is there liter after that we have next unit is milliliter to move from liter to milliliter thousand units is there so one liter is equals to thousand milliliter 28 gets multiplied by 1000. So it will be 28,000. 7 liter to 70 ml. So 7 gets multiplied by 1000 plus 270. So 7000 plus 270. If you add, you will get 7270 ml. Similarly, 10 liter, 450 milliliter. 1 liter is equal to 1000 milliliter. 10 gets multiplied by 1000 plus 45. 450 it becomes 10450 ml. Then next convert into kiloliter. Kiloliter, liter and milliliter. 3 units are there. What is the question given in? Question is in L. And they are asking you to come to KL. L se hame KL ko ana hai. At that time we are going to divide. So 62,000 liter is there. Divide by 1000 it will be 62 kilo liter. The next 7280 liter is there. L se KL ko ana hai. Divide by 1000. So it will be 7 KL and 280 ml. Similar for the next also you have to do.